the family unit as a whole has to heal, for Jessica to heal. And in your case, Jesse, when you were here that first time, I think began to unload a lot of baggage that you were also holding on to very tightly. How have you been doing? Well, I've been um, quit the marijuana for the first time in 20 years. It's been about a month. I feel much better. Um, I just can't wait to, you know, get Jessica here and I'm going to be her gym partner and I'm going to make sure that we stick to it. And I'm going to help her fix what I have done wrong. Yeah. And obviously Jessica isn't with us because she is still in rehab, working emotionally, physically. I, I know that she has lost 18 pounds, working towards becoming yeah. healthier. And, and I think that we finally have a program in place that can work. One of the things we know you guys are all excited now to, to be healthy together, to spend time together, to work out together. We're gonna give your whole family gym memberships so that, cause Jesse, I know you wanna go take your daughter to the gym with you because a family that plays together stays together. And Rosie, I, I also wanna give you a lot of credit because you connected with Jessica when I felt like she had no hope. You know what? To connect with Jessica, to understand her story, not only when it comes to weight struggles, to understand, to connect, to want to have a voice and communicate and feel like you can't talk to anybody. I've been there. I saw her just blossom in front of my eyes. We went out. She talked to strangers. She, she danced. She laughed. And to get the phone calls from me happened to say, Rosie, I feel like I get to talk to people. I feel like I fit in. I feel like I'm a part of. Makes me so proud because you get to see someone come from a place where they had fallen all the way down to say, I want to live, I want to get healthy, I want to be part of a family. And to see that transformation for me, it's like I'm living on purpose. It makes me the happiest to see someone so genuinely happy and to be a part of a show that impacts people's lives in such a loving, positive way. Because like you said, if it wasn't for the show, I don't know what would have happened to this family and certainly would not know what would have happened to Jessica. Well, I cannot personally wait for Jessica to rejoin you, rejoin her family, and I can't wait for the next update. But just no matter what you do, just remember, keep communicating, keep loving, and keep supporting one another. And I think we all can remind ourselves tonight when we're at home with our families we can all communicate better and open those doors. And, and I, I hope that this story of this family taught us all a little bit about ourselves. And thank both of you and keep us posted. And, and honestly, Jessica, if you're watching this, we're all rooting for you.